Do you guys know that there's a legitimate reason why a poodle is known for its famous haircut? Well, if not, we're gonna tell you in today's episode of All About the Poodle. get started make sure you subscribe and you click the little dingy bell so you get notified every time we post a video so let's get to it the poodle is the national dog of France and is also known as the caniche dog or the duck dog despite the association with France the poodle was actually bred in Germany as the dog that hunted ducks the standard poodle actually started as a retrieving water dog over 400 years ago. Their curly coat acts as a protector against the elements of the water, while their swimming ability and their intelligence really help make them a great retrieving dog. The poodle's flamboyant haircut, or their show coat, actually serves a purpose in their earlier years. Duck hunters wanted their dogs to have free range of motion while they're swimming, but they also wanted to protect their vital areas of their anatomy from the cold. They would shave their legs, their necks, and their tail, but would leave the chest, the hips, and leg joints coated for that exact purpose. The rounded tufts on these areas are also known as the pon-pons, not to be mistaken for the cheerleaders pom-poms. So pon, no, pom-pons, not pom-pom. Make sense? Pon, pom-pon. <laughs> Jesus. The poodles have amazing qualities, helping them become luxury dogs. The elegant poodles of standard and miniature size became the favorites to the nobles of France and eventually all of Europe. Their great sense of smell gave them additional work as a truffle hunter. The toy poodle was then bred into the miniature poodle, and the toy poodle became a city-dwelling companion dog in the 20th century in America. So they went from being extremely high fashion dogs that were very, very showy, and they became more of a companion dog as the years went on. And less noble, less rich people started purchasing these poodles. Now they say that these dogs are very, very social and everyone's best friend. They are very affectionate and wonderful with children. They also have a ton of energy. So these dogs are ones that need lots and lots of exercise. Not all of them also get along with other dogs. So when getting them exercise, make sure that they are trained well enough with other dogs before you take them to dog parks but also you can get them exercise in other ways. So long walks, um, if you have a big backyard, that would be great too. Playing catch at parks maybe without other dogs, unless they are well-trained, then taking them to the dog park often is probably what's best. Poodles come in three sizes. The standard size, the miniature size, and the toy size. Standard poodles are about 15 inches tall, at the shoulder, miniature poodles are 15 inches or below or smaller, and toy poodles do not stand any taller than 10 inches tall. The standard sized poodle is the greater size, the one that is stronger and best suited to gain lots of strength and be more of a guardian dog. So there you have it, the poodle. They're fun, they're flamboyant, they're full of energy and they are freaking sometimes just so dang silly billy nilly. Don't add any of that. I don't know where that was going. I hope you loved it. And uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Let us know if you love these videos or if you hate them. And uh, we will see you in our next video. Thanks guys so much. Bye.